Good morning, good morning. Let me encourage you this morning through Jeremiah 29 11. Some of y'all know this, but then some of y'all don't, so I don't assume. But uh, Jeremiah 29 11, God says, for I know the plans that I have for you, right? He knows the thoughts. They're plans to prosper you, not to harm you, to give you hope and to give you a future. So God wants to be that anchor in our life. No matter what situation room that we find ourselves in, no matter what situation that we might be in, even right now, we might be asking God why. We, we don't understand. The pain is unbearable. But you know, God said he'll never put no more on you that you can bear. I know it's a tricky scripture, but listen, when we trust God, he'll give us the strength to endure. Just because it's a situation that's crazy, it's not your fault. I'm not supposed to be here. Why am I here? Somebody did this to me. It does not mean that God is not present. And it does not mean that he wants you to be there. But where you're at, God said he knows that there is a prosperous way for you. There is a future, there is a hope, and we got to keep on standing. We got to stay in the fight. We don't give up. We got to stand still and know that he is God. And what encourages me with the scripture is that because I'm in this story of Joseph and all the situation rooms that he was in that he did not even put himself in, right? Tonight we'll be sharing about where he's at in chapter 40 in Genesis, where he's putting, you know, he's in prison. But yet he has two visitors that come. And even in prison, he still has authority and he has the responsibility and the capability to serve those even in the midst of prison. My God, the baker and the butler. There was purpose for Joseph to be there. There was purpose for him to be thrown there. God wanted those two men to meet Joseph. And we don't know the extent of God's plans, but be encouraged that even in the midst of that, Joseph served him with his giftings of interpreting dreams. So wherever you are right now, understand your gift in that season. Understand that God has you there for a reason and a purpose. And your breakthrough is right around the corner. God bless you and stand still and know that he is God.